You're watching The Breakfast Club. Morning, everybody. It's DJ MV Angela Yee, Charlemagne the Guy. We are The Breakfast Club. One of our favorite people up here today. Young Dro. <laughs> Young Dro. What's good, man? What's up, my brother? Oh, uh, man, fresh in town. I went out last night, had a good time. I heard. MB told us yeah. he's seen you. You performed. When I was getting, walking in the club, he was performing. He was just getting off stage. I told him to wait, bro. I was like, wait a minute. I want Envy to see this. He did not say I, that. I, 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 I swear to God. I seen you on the I, way. I, yeah, I was in that cool. You making up for a lot of time because you was locked up? How you gonna just start it off like that? <laughs> <laughs> how, how you doing? Hey, how are you? Hey, I've been cooling, no, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, but I just got out. I think my brother drove. Good, good like, man. Yeah, and and young Joe Shadis is out on his mixtape and everything. Yeah, yeah. Breakfast Club. Show yeah. did, he man. Sure Come did. on, listen. <laughs> <laughs> now, look, um, I had got in trouble at a college, but it wasn't my fault this time. I was totally innocent. Well, everybody in jail laughed at me when I said that. I was yeah. like, I didn't do it. They bust out laughing, but I, I didn't do it. Mm -hmm. Like we pulled up on the set, and when we walked in, the cops was they they let us in. They, they you know they walked me to the uh, stage of the room or whatever, and I changed and went on the stage and performed. Mm -hmm. Then I'm performing. <clears throat> you know you seen the Juice movie? Yeah, hell yeah. yeah. Dude coming yeah, when like, they walk in. Yeah, the stage. Right. I'm like me? I'm like yeah, right now. So I come off the stage. We walk outside. They got the car surrounded. My man Spody walk up to me like, yo, bro. <laughs> it's a trip in the car. It's like a tool in the car. I'm like, all right, we know who that is. You know what I mean? So we, we they asked me. They was like, so they, they was like, this your gun? I like, I don't, I really don't know about a gun. You feel me? I was like, I didn't, I don't, I don't tote guns. Like you know, what I mean? all these years we've been performing, I don't tote guns. I don't tote guns to shows. That's not what I do. So he was like, it's a gun in the car. I was like, somebody's, it's somebody's in the car. I, I'm not pointer. You feel me? Man, we just didn't want to. Tell on the person. Like, yeah, we don't do that. Don't yeah. make me point at you. But see, I hate people like that in your crew. If that's your gun, man, say that's that your one. gun. Unless Bruh. he was, a, he was a, this, this would have been it for no, him. No, man. So the, so the cop was cool. He was like, yo, y'all just get it together because, you know, one of y'all taking this. I'm going to give y'all a moment. Yeah, yeah that man that gave goes. us a moment. It took like 10, 15 minutes. He was like, F that. Put the cuffs on drugs. I was like, for real? He put me in the back of the car, man. I'm looking out the back of the car like, man, my mama gonna get y'all. <laughs> my mama gonna get y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, wait, I tell my mama this, bro. You can't even eat on my house no more. Ain't no more collard green for you, Spody. You can't eat no more. But we go to jail, bro. So we get down there. We sitting. So <clears throat> they found they found weed, you know what I mean? Stuff like, you know, hip-hop stuff. Yeah. Um, what hip-hop stuff? Weed, hip -hop weed, not, what, some not, lean. How did, who told you? <laughs> you said the fuck up. Yeah, well, yeah, what Charlemagne just said, but mm -hmm. that's that was that's like recreational. Yeah, it wasn't even that much stuff in yeah, there. Yeah. You know, the the weed was less than an ounce. You know, um, that's legal in New York. By yeah, way. and then Cali is totally it's not legal. It's not legal. You just get a fine. Get arrested for you. Get no, a it's fine. A, yeah, it's fine. Less than an ounce is a fine. Yeah, the average cop <laughs> just legal. you know. Yeah. But anyway, we're down there, so we decide to. I I took initiative to say. You know, since we all in here, let's just go ahead and split the charges up. Cause I'm from the project. You know, hey man, look, I take since, the weed. Yeah, you, you take, take the, you take you that. Talk to a lawyer before you start splitting but up no, charges. But no, no, because no, because, no, because we don't want to talk to no lawyer. Cause we could just make bond and we'll deal with that later. Mm -hmm. for, but but for now, all of us has the same charge. Yeah, yeah. You feel me? Mm -hmm. So we, the lawyer gonna say, "What you gonna take?" You feel me? Said, but you gotta have this worked out. We fifty steps <laughs> behind. Man, the man down there is he done went into a phase. He's like, "Yo, I got a career." I'm like, "Who the f get that guy?" Yeah, <laughs> 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 my boy Spody. Like, I'm like, bro, <laughs> come on. Gotta, but that's still your boy, Spody. Spody, Spody, the one. Yeah. yeah, my boy. You know, but that was my partner. You know, I guess he wasn't for me because. He turned the story around and was like, "They're just saying the gun is mine because of who Dro is. No, it's his man. gun. He does. He has a no, record. He, he has. You, man, I'm in, I'm not like, bro. No, we cuffed like from the waist down. I, I'm trying to slide so I can headbutt him. You know what I mean? <laughs> and it, when you know what I mean, I'm like, bro, you know I'm gonna get you, bro. You feel me? But it, and it, we end up doing like 35 days, like so. It's it's been a it's been a. Oh, y'all had to do it? Yeah, we just sitting and we're in Bullock County. These people. It's slow. The the the, uh, the, the, the courtroom is about this big, the, the size of this room. So the people's in there got 30, 40 years, getting 30 and 40, like because it was like a, a, a town that had like surrounding states, so everybody was a flight risk. They don't give buns and set bails and stuff like that too often, two, three times a year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so really, we really got, you know, we had to pay like a lot of money for lawyers. And, 
the Migos had went down there before. Yeah, yeah. And I guess they they whatever they did, but it was like, you know the Migos. Oh, yeah, I was like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Quay, they was like, yeah. yeah, you better ask the Migos what we did to them. I was like, I honestly don't know what you're talking about because you know I don't. It was it was messed up. So we sat down there 35 days, and at at the end, the last day we sat down there, dude was sitting in there. We was going to court. He's I looked. I was like, bro, you're not gonna take the charge. He was like, bro, you ain't no gun, bro. Wow. I I couldn't believe it, like, bro. Don't lie to me. I, like, I, I yeah, did me, not lie to we me. Rolled, we rolled down here together, yeah, my right. brother. Like, cool. <laughs> that was, and he was like, yeah, man. Um, I feel, and So they moved the boy out of the room. I feel for my life from Dro. I'm like, bro, I, I hired you to come on the road to open up. Like, how you feel for your life? Like, that was yeah. crazy. So we did that time, got out. I, it set me back. Like, I missed like seven shows. I'm trying to currently make those up. Mm-hmm. Um. You still got the charges? The charges ain't I still have the charges. I mean, well, they, it, once court come around, it's going to be dropped. But, now, yeah, see, we still... this is my thing, right? When it comes to things like that, it ain't snitching if it, if you if, if the man do something like that and you was like, man, that was his gun. I, what, bro? I don't care, I, man. I, I tell I, people I before they think, get my call, if you got something, I'm telling on you now. If, if you not, don't think Well, I don't want you to make me do that. Right. You feel me? Be a man about it. Yeah, like, yeah. don't make me point, hey, yo, look, it's his. Like, don't do that. That's why I was in jail. Cause yeah. I didn't do that, you know what I mean. So what made them pull you over in the first place? What made them look in the car in the first place? They say we smelled like weed walking in, but That's they walked. I'm sure. Yeah, no, yeah. we didn't, because they walked me to my room. Like if you smell that and you're a cop, like I'll rip. Hey man, you smell like weed. Let me search you. Feel me? They would have searched. They searched me. Nothing was on me. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? This time, nothing was on me. You weren't on probation or anything, were you? Yes. Oh okay. damn so it, man! It but too. it was like a, it like God was just always there, like. Because the probation that I was on, I had completed it. Just like, it, I wasn't even on it. It was just like, oh, you get uh, a year or you pay $1,000. I paid $1,000, but I just it just didn't go in the system right. So mm-hmm. when I went, to the, it was like a warrant. I was like, God. So I went back to the Cab County, and they threw that junk out. Like, went back down there, beat that. Then, so um, now what happens with Spody? Spody going to get what he need. Like, hey, man, if you trying to volunteer the cap on me by your two. You feel me, man? I think that you should sit down. You know what I mean? I don't, 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 because like he talking about his family, bro. I got three, I got three daughters. You know what I mean? I'm not, and a son. I just had a son, a one year old. Like I ain't trying to sit down here either, bro. And Jocelyn me? pregnant. Yeah, my, my daughter. Do- Congratulations! <laughs> you got another one. You got baby on the way. All right. You know what I mean, bro? You got, you out here working. So you think that's my baby? <laughs> Read it on the blind. I asked you about it. You that, said no comment. No comment. That I don't, did. Why not that, just that say no, bro? That, 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 what if it's my baby? Because <laughs> what if it is? He said. And you you're probably the only know. man that can prove I, that she a real woman then, because I thought that was a man that, for the longest. That's a real woman, bro. I okay. would not be in cahoots with, like, cahoots. cahoots. <laughs> cahoots. <laughs> is that the right term? No. Nah, uh, right. I, I would not be associated <laughs> with a man that looks like a woman. It's a problem right there, bro. You just got to look at it. Yeah, Adam's out. Yeah, yeah, So there is a chance that could be your baby. You just don't know yet. I'm the baby dad. Okay. Are you? You are psych. <laughs> <laughs> you know, damn well, I'm not the baby dad. We we was doing some music and we was in the studio and we, we was cool. But that's how I started with Shot TV. Pop, they listen, was doing me, some music and then they got nah. Me and Young Thug in the studio just chilling, cool, and we recording. I think uh, everybody chance was in there, so she peeped in. She was like, "Oh, throw that. Where well, we finna get in? We finna go in." So we just went in and I wrote with her. I took her to the studio, Rocco. We wrote, and all of a sudden. Disappeared. Mm-hmm. And when she disappeared, the last person they saw her was me. Mm-hmm. Walking through the gas station in the hood. Um, we we was at a now, ATM. Hold on, we now, at you ATM. went from the studio to in the gas station and yeah, in we, the hood? Yeah, we went to the gas station, okay. got some blunts, then went to the studio, and n- people were just recording us like, yeah, I, that boy Drew and Jocelyn, you know. Hey, it's, it was more than one day. Did you day put your penis in that it, woman, young girl? I plead the fourth. I just voted for women's rights, huh? <laughs> Vote for Young Drug. <laughs> Vote for Young Drug. Uh, nah, it, it didn't jump off. Like, I like her. She cool. Mm-hmm. But, well, I ain't that. She a little strong in the face, Dro. I seen you with better, I man. I like a, a woman with a good face structure, you know, that could take a hit in case I get into a fight. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> 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 now, are you and Ti really doing a collaboration album? Is that? Oh how? yeah, he was, cool? he who? You and Ti? Man, that's my brother. He's out here with him. Yeah, he's okay. here. Uh, but um, yeah, we can do an album. But we just we we came to the conclusion like the other day. We was like, man, he was like, bro, you know, you know, I've been, you know, I ain't been on my shit lately, you know. 
I supposed to be in a different place, but I'm headed there, you know, and I got this dro revamp thing going on, you mm-hmm. know, and it's it's doing pretty nice, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. I got a um I got a foundation called the Heart Foundation for Kids. It just, you know, help kids develop from the projects, you know. You know, it's just like me being from the projects, like being tore down and rebuilt, you know, just revamping mm-hmm. it, you know what I mean? Still on that same land though, so really me and Tip just polishing up something. Why would you ask if him and T.I. are not cool? That that's, was, that's, that's, that remember is. one time he came up here and he explained the story and T.I. explained the story another way. But it wasn't beef. It was yeah, they a, actually yeah. Two brothers with two different stories. Uh-huh. <laughs> Did you think T.I. was out of line for coming at Wayne? Black lives what? I'm Matter. richer than a mother come yeah. at me with that shit. <laughs> 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 I saw that shit. I was like, I clenched in embarrassment. I was like, no, I, I don't like that. Yeah, right. I would you. No, that was not cool. I mean, I get it, what he was saying. Like, you know, I don't. He, he's successful, you know, and, you know, a lot of people do stuff to, you know, get the police involved. And, you know, you shouldn't stand behind nobody in their wrong. But you're part of the stuff that's happening. Like, your skin tone, it, it shows it, you feel me? Yeah. And we're not getting the good end of the stick, you know? I think all lives matter for that for that cause, you know? Because everybody was saying T.I. was wrong for publicly calling them out because they friends, and he could have called them on the phone. Well, Reggie said no, that, No, 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 you, you, you can't say that because he, he that was a public thing he did. I agree. You, you, you answer him back publicly. Damn right. You, don't, you know what I mean? Somebody whoop your ass outside, whoop their ass back outside. <laughs> I ain't gonna whoop your ass in the house. I ain't gonna know I whoop your ass. Yeah, I gotta whip you on World Star uh, too. You beat World Star? Nah, <laughs> see, see, but I look at it like if, if your friend says something stupid or, or something that don't you make sense. You suppose this. But you, you, you might call him and check him on the line and say, I'm gonna check you, but. I think you should reach out and call if that's your friend. No, nah, that's it's not, not like a good check. That's not a check. That's a premeditated. That's like reality show stand up type. That's like, all right, how many times you said something crazy? And I'm sure Ti called you and was like, bro, bro. But Dro ain't say nothing publicly that affects everybody. He may say something that affect him. Yeah. yeah. But not the whole black yeah, life. Yeah, I might shatter my own life. Yeah, I would life. probably call Dro. <laughs> <laughs> my life don't yeah, matter. My life don't matter. You know what I mean? Period. <laughs> yeah, but I, I saw that. I get it, but I don't get it. Mm-hmm. It's a lot of stuff going on right now. I got children, and I wouldn't want my son to be a Trayvon Martin. Trayvon yeah. Martin. You know, I wouldn't want him to do that. It was Arizona juice, and you know what I mean? Come on, man. You, you just got to understand that it's a lot of stuff going on. People, when I seen the guy get pulled over in um, Charlotte or whatever, that was sick. Man. He was just walking back to the truck, bro. They thing you know, he was laying yeah. on the ground. That matters, bro. Mm-hmm. You feel me? You if, if you're in a bubble where well, you can't see that, I want to be in your bubble. <laughs> I want to go live on Wayne Street because it's a lot of stuff happening on my street. Right. Yeah. I hit Atlanta like two, three times. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like I'm on the southwest side of Atlanta like, them people over there. You know, west side of the street, like you know what I mean? It's crazy. Atlanta done got bad on the low. Man, it was uh, it was like five deaths in a five mile radius. Six, two, four, six deaths. So it was a three. It was a triple shooting, a double murder, a, a car, a body found in the car. <clears throat> I instantly just shut down. I started doing shows out the bathroom. Why Atlanta so bad? <laughs> no, because it seemed like Atlanta always had some money, especially for black. people. Everybody get money now, and in the, in the, I think everybody clicks are just. Feeling each other, like they feeling each other, they feeling themselves. You know what I mean? I think they, everybody think they got something to prove. The younger people have something to prove. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this, and that they're doing it in the wrong way. You know, they could do it. You know, I would rather them, exp- you know, show talent and what they could do in life instead of you know pulling out guns. It's not they gonna kill everybody. Mm-hmm. Ain't gonna be nobody be uh, watch nobody on TV no more. Everybody gonna be dead. Dro, I feel like you and Gucci Man went to the same rehab facility because this is you. You, you sound different. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You look different. Like you look good, Dro. Like, like yeah, this yeah, is Dro revamp. It's a new Dro. <laughs> yeah, I rebuild. You gotta rebuild it. Yeah. You know what I mean, we we I currently have a record label though. Um, it's called Sauce Sauce Music Group. You know, we just we got all the sauce you can't even barbecue without calling me. Got you. Yeah, I got honey mustard. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I got all the sauce. You know, we do mentoring and life skills for the young ones on, at the Heart Foundation. Like we we did uh we played basketball at my old school yesterday. We, it was a great outcome. It was dope. You know what I mean? What made you decide you had to do this whole revamping? For for myself, for my kids, for my mama. You know, my my girl, my daughter's watching. You know what I mean? Yeah. And I'm like, yeah, Dad, you you, you was kind of rocky one time, but but you know, it they always want to see you redo that, you know. Was it one embarrassing moment or something that you looked at, you saw yourself, like you stepped? Yeah, up? I had like 30 days to sit down, 35 days, mm. 
that, you know, and then like for me not to be done did nothing at that time, it was something else going on. So mm. I just had to. Mm. You still drink I, lean and, and, and smoke? Nah, I don't drink lean. I, I kind of like I'm I'm stopping smoking. Um, I don't I don't do much nothing now. I mean, I can look at you and tell you cut something out. I don't. I something can't cut out. Something cut out, bro. Yeah, I cut some stuff out and I pay some stuff on. You know, some positive stuff, but. I don't think you, you you can't do it forever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. You know, you got to find some kind of point where, you know, I need. I mean, like, my what matters most is my children watching, and I don't want. I want to go to heaven at the end of the day. Absolutely. <laughs> look at skin looking good, and smooth teeth looking good. I want to go. What did I look like? You drool didn't really last look time I came in. <laughs> no, I know why you ain't called me. <laughs> <laughs> You ain't call me angry. <laughs> you didn't look bad. Was my teeth? Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> I was drunk when I came here last time. Clearly, my teeth were rotten. No. Golly, man. Now, you you gonna be on Love and Hip Hop season six? They saying? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um. Yeah. You um, signed up to be a main. No. Nah, no. Nah. I just want to finish out what me and Jocelyn did. You okay. Know, me and Jocelyn, when we did the studio thing, we we you know I pull up in the, in the Bentley or the Rolls Royce or whatever, pick her up, go to the studio. Then we you know I thought that was just it, you know. And, but the the the, um, the network been looking for me like, mm -hmm. yo, we want draw. I wasn't in the position to be on nobody's TV. You know what I mean? I didn't want to let nobody in my my personal business. You feel me? Mm -hmm. But at the same time, I wanted to finish out what me and her started, and it's. It's alright. Oh, You're not gonna be beefing with Stevie J, are you? That's one thing I told him I would not do. Okay, you so know, I don't do y'all get be along? Because I know he's very protective. We don't know, you know. I, I'm from Atlanta, Georgia. Me and I don't know Stevie J, like, mm -hmm. period. You know, and I don't, I don't. But you know what though? I think he texted my phone one time. It said what? He was like, "Yo, get at me, to Stevie." I, if, if it might have been, it might have been another Stevie. Might be Stevie but Wonder. I, Stevie Wonder can't see, bro. <laughs> Let me drive. Let me drive, Joe Delbin. Matter of fact, drive me. Let me drive over these boy hours. <laughs> nah. But what he said. But it, he was like, "Yo, get at me, to Steve." I, I want. I thought. I, I wonder was he calling me about? You know what I mean? I was like, I, I wouldn't do that. You know. Right, right, right. Yeah. So you didn't hit him back? No. What are we gonna talk about? I'm definitely not dating this girl. Mm -hmm. You know, and I wouldn't. Want, I don't got nothing to talk about. It's a headline. We, it, it, was, it was a headline on VH1 said, "Young Drill talks about I'd say, getting say, Jocelyn pregnant and beef with Stevie J." Nah. It was, they took something off my page. I, I just might go on my page and spaz. Hey, man, listen, man, y'all around here messed up by the chick, man. What you about to worry about who paying your bills? I said something like that. Okay. And they were like, yeah, that's a Steve J shot. Mm -hmm. Don't What's worry up? about that white one behind you. All right, cool. He said, <laughs> drove said, jump like. Uh, <laughs> it was, hey, it's a fine lady in here, bro. Who? She got long hair with a brown. Man, that's it. She got like an older lady. Man, she fat as a food boy. She must be one of the sales she, executives. No, she's on the radio station over there. Helen Little? What? With what? the big ass? Helen Little got a big ass. Yeah, she do. <laughs> she want some money right now, though. What, huh? Show me some money. She oh, do? whoa, okay, yeah. Pim, I need to okay, be in your... No, no, we back with the game. She an Eagles fan. I'm a, you know, I'm a Giants fan. I'm uh, a Giants beat the Eagles. I got She got a giant booty. <laughs> yes, she do. Yeah, bro. Okay, guys, stop talking about Helen. She's Helen doing, was Helen fine. Knows. I mean, well, she pretty, too. Yeah. I like her. <laughs> she pretty, too. Yeah. Very yeah. established woman. She used to be a program director. Mm -hmm. She did? Yeah. Now she got, like, one of the top-rated midday shows in the country. I used to be a drug dealer. <laughs> was it the jail that got you sober? I think, um, you know, even when the last time I came, yeah. I was always working on it. You yeah, know? Yeah, yeah. Everybody knew it needed working. I think the, the room for improvement is the biggest room in the house. You know, I think that the master bedroom needs working on all the time. Gotcha. You know what I mean? So I think that I should better myself immediately. You know what I mean? If I want to continue to have success or even do this right here. You know what I mean? Does so that mean Young your... Joe is settling down now too? A one woman kind of man. You got a lady, man? bro. You got a lady. One yeah. woman kind of man. Yeah, I got a lady. My lady, my new lady, got like six degrees. Okay. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I used to date a girl named Booty. It's just turned all the way around. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah, turned all the way around. You like, said a woman that ate booty. What? Name who? Sound like you said my, uh, my old girl named Booty. Like you remember? Name Booty. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like What's up, Booty? Like booty. Yeah, yeah, she was just a young chick. I, I you know, I was a different guy. No, but Shotta right now don't play though. She really that's cookie like. She got she, you in check. Yeah. Has she helped in your growth? Yes. She's actually a great person. Mm -hmm. Counselor. You know, she's gonna get her doctrine soon. Where? Yeah. So you'll get married. Uh pressure, 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 pressure. <laughs> pressure. <laughs> <laughs> Let them enjoy hey, their relationship. Mean, I don't know what you talking about. <laughs> <laughs> hey, now, um, I, I want to do that. 
I want to do everything that's that's like the American dream. I want to, mm-hmm. you know, I want to I want to have that family. I want to change for my kids. I want to raise them to be better people. And you know, right now my daughter is. I'm gonna take her phone when I get home. Uh-oh. She like she failed she two like, classes. She, like two it? classes. Wow. I'm gonna get on that butt when I get home. What so classes? She, uh, she in art and art. Yeah, that's but you you gotta watch that type stuff. When you're trying to get into school, and you know what I mean, watch your grades for everything. You yeah. gotta watch that; it'll follow you. What grade you is go, she in? She's a knife. Okay. Freshman year. Yeah, she, she's. A, she's How's, is your relationship with your um, daughter's mother better now? I know you guys were rocky when you we did. Were, we, it is. You know, we had a long. We we had a breakthrough two days ago. That's great. So, yeah. And, what was the breakthrough? Um, you know, we was just we just say how we felt about you know what I used to be in the past and how, how what I took her through. You know. Uh, I took I took the blame for it, you know what I mean? I took I did a lot of crazy stuff. You know, um I wasn't paying attention if 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 you'd say, you know, uh careless, taking stuff for granted, you know? Right. So now it's mm, it's just a refined moment for me, you know. Are you going Is to church right every, right? Are you going to church every Sunday, Drew? Not every Sunday. Yeah. <laughs> but I go, you know. I can't really just claim every Sunday. Well, my family is a praying family, you know, yeah. from the South. You know, I grew up in a church. I want to just, I want to go back the way I used to, but I'm kind of ashamed to go because uh, I cry too much. I, I, I can't do it. What you when you when they start singing like? On. You be good with your glasses on. If you come through tickling my jaw, I, I, and you just be like, there like you go. Is yeah. it the choir or the sermon? The choir. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's the song always. What the song hymns. is it? Um, you want me to just sing? You just want me you to want open? Sing the song? <laughs> I just want to know the song. Center of my joy. Center of my joy. Center of my joy. Center of my joy. Yeah, it was the first song I ever sung in church for my grandma. Mm-hmm. So yeah, it kind of takes me there. So you know the words verbatim. I had to. It was a cassette tape. I had to learn it. Get the people something. Drow the judge might be watching. Jesus, help Charlemagne because he's trying to make me sing. <laughs> 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 now with this Drew revamp, what can we expect with the new music? Okay, so, say it again. With Drew being revamped mm-hmm. now, what do we expect from this new music? Um, I want I, I want to talk about something different. What I you use, want to talk about? Um, how 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 you should change for the good. I, I want I want to I want to still talk about where I came from mm-hmm. and what what it matters to be a good person. I want to talk about everything that I've saw. I want to talk about the things that I want to do, and some of the most some of the, some of the stuff that that matters to me. You know what I mean? Like, you know, TV and music, and you know, I want to be a comedian when I when I get older. Mm-hmm. Really? Oh uh, yeah. I can see that. Um, I you taking want, tips from Duval? Yeah. I mean, well, you know, when I first met Duval, I joined Duval out. Yeah, yeah. It was real funny too. But mm-hmm. well, he got me back like eighty times after that. So, <laughs> <laughs> but it, it, it's it's been it's been a long trip, and it's gonna be a longer one. So I'm really cool. I got a whole new I got a whole new team, publicist, eyelash vision. You know, Mimi and Shante. Um, I kind of like the only person that's still on. Like I've never really had nobody. Yeah. Publicist. You know all that manager stuff. I never really had nobody, so really, I just cleaned the house about whatever I right. the old stuff I had, and now I just got a whole nother team. My my team is half of my team is based out of New York, um, and then the rest of us are down south. Um, so really, it's a whole new thing. You know what I mean? You never been real reckless with your music though. Like it wasn't like an uh, uh, over sensationalization of the streets too much. Like it was just all about having fun. Yeah, you know it, and that's what I fly. that's what I wanted to do. Like w- when I was young, I didn't I didn't want to rap about stuff that was you know you could see. Or like you know, I wanted you to use your imagination every time. Like I wanted to animated rappers from the south, you know. Yeah, we appreciate you joining us, man. Oh yeah, man, Joe, thank you. Look forward to always welcome, music. Drew. Thank you, thank you. Thank there you. you have it, the new improved young Drew. You want to <laughs> leave us with a prayer? Or? Yeah, strong hand. Come on. Oh boy. Yeah, dear God, thank you for this breakfast that we had at the club. Not the nightclub, it was actually a radio station. Um, thank you for Charlemagne for not cracking jokes in the worst way. All three of y'all did good today. All three of you. Thank you, God. Amen. 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 <laughs> All right. <laughs> Young Dro. Never had a prayer like club. that before. Good morning. <laughs> the Breakfast Club. Every weekday morning. Tune in.